Hello guys, my name is Fernando and uh, I will be showing you how to set up or configure your STBMU application on Android Box which pretty much is an emulation of uh, the well-known device Mac 250 or Mac 254 whichever you guys want uh, this is just an emulation for the Mac devices so okay we're gonna go ahead and um, select on um, STBMU Pro which is our uh, application if you notice since um, when you get a brand new application it will it will give you this screen so you guys have to go to uh, where it says configure application click on it sorry about the quality on my video um, so then you guys can go to profiles click select the profile and then here you're gonna type in you know whatever name you guys want for your application or your profile so I'm just gonna do IP TV and then um, click OK then you guys go to portal settings click on it and then you guys enter your URL portal um, or the uh, URL address from your server which is given by your IPTV provider in this case will be biohazard TV so our portal for our services is V I V I D the D D N S the net and then we do column two five four six one forward slash and we add a lower case letter C at the end click OK so we have our portal now we go to STV configuration uh, first option on the menu STV model you guys do a Mac 250 then we go to firmware and select uh, 2.18 R19 click on it screen resolution I would recommend to do auto so it will adapt to your TV screen size automatically if you notice that is a MAC address that will be um, preloaded in your application and it will be different for every single user so um, I don't recommend to use this MAC address as the server or any server will not allow it so like I said um, that MAC address will be different for every single application so that MAC address is to be given to your um, IPTV provider and he will hook it up on the server and then send you the URL portal which I already showed you before so we go back we go back again and then we just toggle on the screen you're gonna get this menu over here click on the little three lines in the left upper corner go to reload portal and then we just uh, wait a few seconds oh. reload again okay there you go it, it's open so you see 
there is a loading bar in the middle of the screen that that it's a good sign that means you guys are getting connected to the server then we just wait there you go guys so we have a, a really nice interface for our biohazard tv um we have uh, this all um categories of channels you can go up and down with your remote you can go right or left video club if your iptv service has vod it will be here tv series the same radio you guys have a um a link to youtube settings i do not recommend to go in this uh, tab there there is not actually nothing to do in there uh, you guys can connect to internet with this tab and account you guys can check your mac address and when your current um subscription will expire so we just go to um USA channels you here you can uh, you know select the channel click OK there you go if you guys want to go back to the menu where it shows all the channels just uh, click back once Oh, sorry. Just okay. And then you just scroll down to your to your uh, next channel to play. There you go. To extend the the screen, you guys have to click play twice, so it will go bigger. And then remember, click back once. It will show you this uh, screen. Um, you guys can. Uh, click left on the channel and it will take you to the um, TV guide which you know tells you pretty much what it's playing at the moment and also a brief description on the show or movie or whatever you guys are watching then you guys go back okay and then well let's see my premium networks which will be our um cinema channels let's see there you go then uh you click back once again it'll take you here and then if you toggle uh, I'm using a, a keyboard with mouse. If you toggle, uh, you guys will see these buttons over here. So you also will see um, this little hand. Sorry, this little hand that it, uh, if you click there, it's gonna hide all your buttons. So if you guys want to get out completely from uh, this application, you will have to long press the back button and then select OK. And that's it, guys. Hope you guys uh, find it easy to follow. Thanks.